Can you guys introduce yourselves? Hello, my name is Hafiz. Uh, my name is Rajis. <laughs> okay, and how do you usually feed the sun bears? Uh, we feed them three times a day. Mm. In the morning, they will get uh, maybe a new pellet. Mm -hmm. And maybe half of the watermelon. Mm -hmm. mm. So in the afternoon, they get the other half of the watermelon and some sweet snacks like uh, sugar cane mm -hmm. and coconut. Mm. Okay, so what problems do you face with feeding them? Mm. Uh, <laughs> the best, both of them don't have the same personality. So mm -hmm. they have their own preference for food. Mm -hmm. So sometimes they don't eat all of the food. Mm -hmm. uh, so we have to be observant of what type of food we eat. Okay. And then, uh, so what do you actually hope to achieve? Uh, from this device. From, yeah. from, or from any device that y'all can think of? Our, our best they are very complex animal like this. they need a lot of stimulating and rich So for bears we hope we have a, like we have to think of a device that can keep them occupied for the whole day. Yeah, keep them busy. Because like bears in the wild they usually forage throughout the day for them. The Honey Pumper 3000 was designed as an enrichment toy for the sun bear. It can pump honey to four different outlets and the bear will have to depend on its sense of smell to find which outlet the honey is coming from. The Honey Pumper 3000 has three different modes for the zookeeper to select. Constant, manual and automatic. It's a fun way to let the zookeeper play with the sun bear and keep it occupied as well as it's trained its natural hunting abilities. The design prevents the curious bears from biting and breaking it. It's also easy to dismantle for cleaning regularly in order to prevent bacteria and nasty pests. So let's get pumped up, honey. <laughs> <laughs>